In other words, this is not the end game. These occasions also have a great significance to your parents, representing the realization of one of their greatest dreams to better equip and prepare their children to the demands of the world and the future. In the past few years that you have spent in De La Salle Araneta University, I am certain that you have gone through numerous experiences. Some have been quite challenging, forcing you to go beyond your comfort zones, to accomplish an academic goal, or work with people whose backgrounds are vastly different from yours. Others have been quite instructive and encouraging, compelling you to think of ingenious solutions to the tasks that have been assigned to you or adapt to the changing demands of your professors and coursework. Without a doubt, these experiences have helped you, have helped shape how you think act and see the world. Indeed, they have transformed you into the person that you are today. As you look ahead to your next big adventure, you will find that life has a lot in store for you. With many pleasant things that you are still to experience, your life's journey will also be fraught with numerous challenges and riddled with many uncertainties. The important thing is to never give up and to take every failure in stride and with an open heart. These failures will only serve to build your character and strengthen your resolve to the best that you can be. On a final note, I urge you to always be kind, and the famed American novelist George Saunders could not have put it in any better. And I quote, do all the other things, the ambitious things, travel, get rich, get famous, innovate, lead, fall in love, make and lose fortunes, but as you do, to the extent that you can err in the direction of kindness." End quote. Regardless of where your chosen paths take you from here on now, I hope that you will look back to your graduation day as a day brimming with optimism and promise. So congratulations to the batch 2018-2019, and may you continue to make your God and country proud. Thank you in our hearts.